With us today we have the iBurst modem manufactured by Kyocera. Uh, here you have a USB modem plugged into the back of the UMR. And uh, in order to get this combination to work, you need firmware ver version 2.0, which is available off our website. Uh, here we have the, the computer connected uh, to the UMR over Ethernet and uh, the login screen access and as you'll see the reported uh, backhaul technology there is Kyocera iBurst so in order to configure this combination as iBurst doesn't have a SIM card holder or anything like that it requires a username and password to access the network so to configure that we click on modem and then you go over to uh, PPP And here you type your username, or whatever it is, and password, and push save settings. And this will take effect after a restart. So then we do a restart. And that should do the trick. Here we don't have iBurst network, but in your country, wherever you, if you're using it, it'll work. No problem. 